So here we're given a control mechanism and a force applied through this rod here. And we want to break this into the X and Y components and find those. We're also given a ratio here at the angle at which it's applied. And we can use this to make ratios in order to find our answers. We're just going to need to do a little bit of math first. So we know that a Pythagorean theorem would say 12 squared plus 5 squared is going to equal C squared, the hypotenuse direction here. And if we work this down, we'll find that C is equal to 13. And now we have all the information that we need to use ratios for this. So we can find that the X component is going to be 260 newtons times negative uh, 12 because of our X and Y trends here. So negative 12 divided by 13 is our ratio. And so our X component will equal uh, 240 newtons uh, negative. And we can do the same thing for the Y. So our Y component is going to be 260 newtons times, once again, a negative 5 because it's acting downward in the Y. So a negative 5 divided by 13. And our Y component will be a negative 100 newtons. And we can also take this another step and write this in vector notation and write it as negative 240i minus 100j. And this is all in newtons.